don't know why, but this one feels right. Italians. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I I don't get that. Lavernius Tucker. What do they bring like the internet and show R V B or something? <laughs> no, he brings them out from the um the show into real life. Yeah. I'm really tempted to do that because that actually kinda makes sense, but for some reason this calls to me. <laughs> okay. Ooh. I hope you've been paying attention to the chat, Ned. I haven't seen anything. Are you using global chat or chat with game members? Okay. Oh, okay. I am the chat czar. No. Studies show that lab rats navigate mazes fifty percent faster after being exposed of to. Of course, you can spell. I have so many good ones for this. I have so many good ones for this. I really wish I could play. <laughs> okay. Come on, Nid. The Nid face is a lie. Studies show that lab rats navigate mazes 50% faster after being exposed to Grandpa's ashes, my humps, John Wilkes Booth. I just I imagine with my humps, it's like they're, they're moving I'm faster because they see these awesome yeah, boobs. I think anything would be faster after yeah. anything but would my be humps, faster. my lovely lady lumps, man. That says humps, not lumps. My humps, my lovely lady lumps. It's a song. I am the boob czar. <laughs> this is your captain speaking. Faster in your seatbelts and prepare for Steve's stupidity. Uh, I have two different ones. What do you guys want to see? Something gross or something violent? I want to see Steve getting hit over the head with something. Well, excuse the fuck out of me. <laughs> this is your captain speaking. Faster in your seatbelts and prepare for dying. We're all gonna <laughs> die. Uh, this is your captain speaking. Fasten your seatbelts and prepare for an alternate universe in which boxes store things inside inside of people. Oh my god, This is your disturbing. captain speaking. Fasten your seatbelts and prepare for a gentle caress <laughs> of the inner thigh. I think I would need to pass my seatbelts and prepare for this. <laughs> yes. So that yes. knows me. Well, the the alternate universe is always... You need to fasten your seatbelts for them. I am the alternate universe card czar. I spent my whole life working toward blank, only to have it ruined by blank. So is this an alternate universe? Because we had this card before? Possibly. Are you an alternate universe? Do we even exist outside of this YouTube channel? Maybe. I spent my whole life working toward media coverage, only to have it ruined by Ray's sombrero. I'm sorry, because I know nothing of Ray. That one is going to lose So the second one's the story of Scythane's life right now, right? Because <laughs> he's lo he still needs to get a, a microphone. And Wait a second. Oh, yeah. The Blue Yeti microphone, only to have it ruined by flying sex snakes. Is Hussey a flying sex snake, Psych? <laughs> mm, no. I spent my whole life working toward dancing with a broom, only to have it ruined by Viagra. Well, now you can't bring Man. it close to you without it hurting. You guys suck. These are all pitiful. Seriously? Yeah. Maybe you're just that funny. Maybe Ray's sombrero would be good if I knew it. The blue Yeti microphone and flying sex snakes, thats there's no real connection there. Dancing with a broom in Viagra has the closest connection, but it's still crappy. It doesn't have to have a close connection. It just needs to be funny. Exactly. Neither of them are funny. Well, just because it doesn't have a close connection doesn't mean it's... I'm giving you a middle finger, Dan. Well, they need to be accurate. Yes. Who gives a shit? I still so that's it. why Seven likes Steve. He understands his life. <laughs> wait. What? Let's just do blank again. Wait, did someone is... leave Skype? No. Scythe, you there? Scythe? Yeah. All right, good. Scythe is Would alive. Would you take the first one? <laughs> All right. Why have you been quiet, Scythe? I wasn't quiet. There's some irony Let's do in mind, because we've played of the course. card before. Shut up, Dan! I'll probably explain it's fine. I gotta do the logical one. <laughs> loaded hands. I can't believe I got loaded yeah. this round. Nah. Yeah, this round has I just have the bad hand. 
Why is everyone being quiet? I am the now? drunk czar. The Japanese have developed a smaller, more efficient version of their own penis. This is kind of. I. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. The Japanese had developed a smaller, more efficient version of flying robots that kill people. AIDS. <laughs> the penny whistle solo from My Heart Will Go On. All things considered, they have giant Gundams, so if they can make smaller robots, that'd probably be more efficient. Maybe. Damn it. It's just like, you want people to die from AIDS faster? Here you go! Here's a new strain of AIDS that we're gonna unleash on the world! Make a, Make haiku. a haiku. Doesn't actually Ooh. have to be in a haiku, it just has to be funny. So let me just explain to that, because it's like 575 or something, or? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Do we want to try to make it 575? You're not going to get any extra points for doing that. Long. Just shout out. <laughs> You're not going to get any, uh, you know. Yeah, I don't have anything that's five. Let's try to at least make it close, then. No, just give me whatever's funny. So just give me your funniest cars, or if you just want to throw away your shittiest cars, go ahead and do that too. But you probably won't win this round. But we still have plenty more rounds, so. I might have won. Okay. We'll Maybe. see about that. I might have won. If you use a blank card, I'm assuming you're probably going to win. I don't have any more blank cards. I had the one. But that one was perfect, though. Come on, Dan. Get, get on Dan. with it. Get on with it. It's funny because this version of Flux I have is Monty Python. Hope, depression, friends with benefits. <laughs> a spastic nerd, superpowers, world peace. A falcon with a box on his head. Embryos, embryonic stem cells, a robot bird. Yes. Psyched for life. Yeah. I love that one because it's like hope, depression, friends with benefits. Yeah, I was trying to make it, it sound like it could be a poem. Well, it's also it's true. Yeah. I yeah, am hope, the librarian czar. What is my favorite book? I actually do have a book in my list of cards. Grave robbing. The Trail of Tears. Subduing a grizzly, a grizzly bear and making her your wife. Is that a how-to book or something? <laughs> I think so. Um, I don't know. I've never read that book. I, uh, the Trail of Tears is a very interesting book, but I, and I haven't robbed any graves lately. But grave robbing, a how-to to grave rob would be a really funny book. Damn straight. What's it doing a grizzly bear making her your wife? Seriously, man. <laughs> yeah, I That's got twisted. That one. <laughs> oh, if only I had... Damn it. Hard. I had a really good one for this. Scythe might understand this. And who knows? Oh, great. <laughs> RT Animated Adventures is doing another... They're all Rooster Teeth related. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> 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 oh, great. Sheila the Tank is doing another eating in a binocular game. Let's play. Oh, shit. Oh, great. Gamfrey is doing another wiping in a game. <laughs> Come on, Scythe, do the right thing. It, pandering doesn't work when everyone does it. I actually have a card that says do the right thing. <laughs> Thank you, Scythe. Okay. I am the albino czar. In the beginning, there was blank. And the Lord said, let there be blank. If any Christians watch this, they're going to be pissed off the, to hell. I feel like I wish I had a blank card, and then it could be oh like, God, in the beginning the there was nothing, and then the Lord said, let there be Nidface. That probably would have won. I've won. I got this. Can't tell. Oh. Uh, I like mine. Alright. Show me what you got, bitches. In the beginning, there was a beached whale, and the Lord said, let there be the Hamburglar. In the beginning, there was a stray pube, and the Lord said, let there be knobs. In the beginning, there was no clothes on, penis, and vagina, and the Lord said, let there be rupees. Oh, sh I guess the Lord is pervy. Uh, no, no it, it, it's, it would be, in the beginning, there was roofies, and then what the, the Lord said, let there be oh, no hey, clothes look, on. Oh, hey, look, Dan, finally got another card. Come on, another... a stray pube oh. in, and knobs? Roofie. 
roofies in the chat. What the fuck? That one was second, man. Tonight on Snick, are you afraid of blank? <laughs> I am the roofie czar. I forgot what I just did. <laughs> I am such did I do a anything I regret? Please tell me. Guys, guys Nate, you, you banged... Guys, um, we'll let you, know. you banged another YouTube channel. Shut you up. banged Scythe Vane. Shut up. I'm a horrible person. Sit so on Snick. Are you afraid of Mavin slash fiction? Yeah, I actually am. Sit so on Snick. Are you afraid of a black male in his early 20s last time wearing a hoodie? Are you afraid of Nickelback? I can't do the second one because that would mean I'm racist. So I gotta do this one. Yeah, I'm a horrible person. I had the black male. Yeah. I'm not afraid of Nickelback. I like his songs. <laughs> I did too. I was just making the joke. I am the card czar. What's the next Happy Meal toy, bitches? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm already going to pick shiny objects. <laughs> but I'm going to read the rest. Death by Steven Seagal. A lamprey swimming up the toilet and latching onto your taint. Yeah, shiny objects. Were shiny <laughs> objects are perfect. Sam and Dan, you are so easily amused. Mm -hmm. Well, the other two are dumb. You can't make a toy out of that. Yes, you can. <laughs> Just give the kids an actual lamp for life. Damn it. I'm gonna j oh, I should have picked the lamprey one for this one. Damn it, I had a really good one for this one. Why is it I'm always in when I have a really good one? <laughs> I actually kind of like mine. All right, come on, Scythe. We got to do the right thing. You got to pick mine. Let me just gauge my Steve senses. What'd you bring a live studio audience? How do you like bring all that, man? I feel like there should have been a TV show that was like a sitcom, and it like knew it was a sitcom, and then like, one of the kids brought the studio audience to show That would have been Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Yeah. Hey, my Steve senses worked pretty yeah. damn well. Uh, that was pretty good. I also like something that is top because that was mine. I am the Fresh Prince of Zar. Dear Abby, I'm having some trouble with Blank and would like your advice. <laughs> I'm having some trouble, do some trouble doing the right thing? The right thing and would like your advice. I'm having some trouble with stabbing the shit out of Katrina's son and would like your advice. I'm having some trouble with wearing Nicolas Cage's face and would like your advice. Dear Abby, I seem to have misplaced my face and have been given Nicolas Cage's. What should I do? Signed in... Damn it. It's like you can't Damn do it. it or else you explode. <laughs> Which one was yours, Scythe? Was it Nicolas Cage? I am Nicolas Capri Cage. Sun Czar. Money can't buy me love, but it can buy me Capri Sun. God damn it. <laughs> oh, this one's perfect. I can't wait to see sides. This one might win. Money can't buy me love, but it can buy me being a busy adult with many important things to do. Money can't buy me love, but it can buy me the human body. That's also pretty good. <laughs> money can't buy me love, but it can buy me almost giving money to a homeless person. We're all pretty good, but that's just... yeah, so. that, that was, I love that one. Oh. Wow! I am the tiny penis czar. How am I compensating for my tiny penis? The answer to that is I am not. Oh, <laughs> I am compensating oh, by using flesh-eating bacteria. Oh, I am compensating by speaking in Morgan Freeman's voice. I am compensating by spending a lot of money. All of them are good. Yeah. But I think Morgan's Morgan Freeman's voice would get you laid the most. Yeah, I was yes. gonna say Morgan Freeman's voice is the best. <laughs> yes. Uh. Just narrate your sex. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! I wish you knew that this one. <sighs> <laughs> I like the third one. Ah. <laughs> uh. Beat him, Scythe. Uh, is, is the third one a companion cube? Fuck it. You know what I'm gonna do. Fuck. Come God on! Party Mexicans! God damn it, Jeremy! Shut up! 
Scythe, your Steve sense didn't work. I had the companion cube. I had the party oh, sorry, and I was thinking Jeremy. I am the companion cube czar. I went from blank to blank, all thanks to blank. I already czared this one. A hush fell over the crowd. Nid, God, fucking Scythe were deciding which cards would make Lord Xavier laugh the most. For he was their Lord and Savior, Lord Xavier. <laughs> Nid is Jesus. I am God, fuck. I am God, fuck. I am Sorry, God, Sorry, you want to say something? No, I am God, fuck. <laughs> I am God, fuck. I went from same-sex ice dancing to ass to mouth, thanks, all thanks to the boners of the elderly. Women. The boulders of the elderly women. I went from hot cheese to figgy pudding, all thanks to chugging a lava lamp. Figgy Jesus pudding Christ, pops. dude. I went from serfdom to deregulating the mortgage market, all thanks to using CPR to treat a bullet wound to the head. <laughs> oh, good old rooster teeth. Red versus uh, yeah. That was a good one. Yes. Yeah, no, come on. Not more pretty good. Although I will have to say, chugging a lava lamp is pretty badass. <sighs> because I lost a thing, I'm gonna go chug uh the chug a lava lamp. Seven, what? Tell tell them about the lava lamp story about uh Wesley's sister. Uh, uh, <laughs> this oh, one is a good oh, one. Oh, Scythe, Scythe. Who's this one anyway? Scythe, tell tell them about Wesley's sister and the lava lamp. <laughs> Tell him, tell him, tell him. Come on, man. Siphon, uh, please. I don't want to. Do it, do it. It's a good story, man. Yeah. I only remember. Okay, so Siphon has this one friend, Wesley. And uh, Wesley's sister borrowed Siphon's lava lamp to use it as a bong. Oh, God. So, <laughs> yeah. When I How would you use it as a bong? Acid, sniffing glue turned into a hot mess. When I was chipping on acid, a canoe with enough room for fill turned into heartwarming orphans. When I was chipping on acid, a wet paper towel turned into Chugga Conroy's awful puns. I don't know who the fuck Chugga Conroy is. I don't think any of us do. Oh, come on. Damn right. Was yours a canoe with enough yeah. room to fill? I don't know who oh, they're shit. saying Wait. Phil is. Yeah, yeah. I am the Phil Czar. This month's Cosmo. Spice up your sex life by bringing Nid into the bedroom. If I had a blank card, I'd probably <laughs> have Let's be honest. If any of us had a blank card, we would just put Nid face. <laughs> well, maybe. Nidface or Duncan? Fuck that Depends guy. on the situation. Okay. <laughs> Spice up your sex life by bringing insatiable bloodlust into the bedroom. That's by bringing up. tangled slinkies into the bedroom. Spend all that time having ta untangling the slinkies <laughs> instead of having sex. Yeah. Spice up your sex life by bringing fear itself into the bedroom. So Nid. Having all of your souls removed because Nid is a Dementor. Yeah, basically. Um, the only thing, well, I guess the first, the for this first one and the sec and the third one would actually spice up your sex life a lot. Tangled Slinkies would do the opposite. And since some people are actually into this kind of weird shit. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I knew insatiable boil would work on Dan. Yeah. <laughs> 